Yesterday, a really insane glitch happened in Pet Simulator X. Most people don't know about it, but for the people it happened to, it was pretty crazy to experience it, and some of them got really rich because of it. They fixed it literally within minutes, but I'll be showing you guys what happened. But before we get started, do you want a free huge? Just like the video, subscribe, and comment your Roblox username. Here's last video's winner. I'm sending them a huge rock named Banana Rock. Let's go. But do you also want a chance to win a Titanic Capybara? Well, I am officially sponsored by something called Fresh Cut. You guys might have heard of it. Night Fox is also sponsored by them. Links to sign up is in the description. And if you already signed up on phone, go to enter for an invite code and type in Telanthric. But basically, for the Titanic Capybara, you just gotta make a pet some X art and use hashtag pet some X art. Or well, PSX art. I even made one. Look at this. This is a really nice pet some X art. Anyways, let's get into the crazy glitch that happened literally yesterday in Pet Simulator X. Now, I was just chilling, trying to trade some event pets. I did end up trading like all of them away, by the way. Well, at least the ones in my inventory. I still have like a thousand more event pets in my bank. I don't know why I have so many, but anyways, one of my friends DM'd me on Discord this video. So let's take a look at it. As you can see, someone is opening some lucky eggs that you get, but then they get a whole bunch. Like, literally, look at that. What is that? Literally, what is that? They're getting like 100, and no, this is not Pet Simulator Z. The weird Pet Simulator Z games literally have on the side, like, their Discord server or, like, extra currencies that don't even exist. This is the real Pet Simulator X, and one of my friends also did a video on this, and other people in the comments had this happen to them. Now, I'll explain exactly what happened in a minute after we watch this, but look at how many pets this guy is getting, and in his server, some people also got huges. This is why I said some people got really, really rich from this, because just hundreds of eggs are being hatched super, super fast, and I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is not a hack either or something. This was a glitch that happened yesterday, but that's pretty much it. Just people got a whole bunch of eggs. Now, exactly what happened is, in the video, can't really be seen, but the board in the back is glitched where you know how in the lucky block world let's teleport to it real quick every 10,000 points you get each block is worth a certain amount of points you get eight times super lucky eggs now how do you get a whole bunch of super lucky eggs like that well in this video it was basically just glitched where instead of every 10,000 points you get eight times lucky eggs every single lucky egg you break or like every lucky block like let's say I broke this one you would get eight now in the video it paused for a minute probably just because it was lagging so hard but pretty much every single lucky block that was broken, that was eight eggs for everyone in that server. Now, this happened in multiple servers. Like, if I go to my friend in his videos, you should subscribe to him, by the way. Someone said they were in the game, didn't get a huge, and apparently people hashed, like, seven, but the crazy thing is the wrap of lucky went up. So, I mean, now it's going down. Someone else was in a server like that. They said, I thought someone was hacking. I opened 16 at once. I opened the Bible egg when the egg goal was going. Well, that's kind of smart. I guess if you, like, open it while people are farming in a server, then that can happen. But that is a pretty crazy glitch, and if you're wondering why servers restart, like, if you're playing the update, you probably saw servers restarted really, really fast, right after they restarted once. Like, I remember while I was streaming, well, it didn't happen in my server, but the game shut down, and then literally, like, another minute later, it shut down again, and that was probably, well, it was more like maybe five minutes, but I'm pretty sure that was the time this was happening in some servers, so they shut it down as fast as possible after they realized so that people don't get a whole bunch of pets, but if you're wondering, wondering why in the beginning the amount of people that owned this stuff like the new huges there is an index in the lucky world for some reason okay there's like a mailbox and index in every world except for the lucky block one but we can actually see here the new chroma huges already 7500 chroma luckies exist and 1500 chroma lucky block mimics exist now i don't know why lucky block mimic isn't worth that much more than huge chroma lucky make sure you use telanthicvalues.com by the way we have values of those really updated a lot but like literally Literally, hundreds of them existed within that short period of time. Probably because a lot of people were getting them really, really fast, and it wasn't like you had to purposefully do that glitch. It was just in some servers, literally just by opening a lucky block, you would get eight eggs like that, and, like, everyone would get eight eggs. So it's pretty crazy. That is, like, okay, normally, if you have a lot of people grinding, it takes around 30 seconds to get eight eggs, but when that was happening, you could get, like, eight eggs basically every second and maybe 16 eggs for a second. So that makes it almost 100 times easier to get the huges. And sometimes when you mine the lucky block, it wouldn't spawn eight just because of how many it was spawning. It must have been lagging badly. But still, that is a large amount of eggs. Way more than you can get normally. But I got some other cool information for you guys. So if we go, I don't know why I teleported back here. If we go back to the spawn world, we can actually see the board in the back. Now they're voting.
voting. Should the lucky block world be permanent? And I did a vote on my stream. 86% of people voted that the update was a W. Well, I'm just gonna say yes, because it'd be cool if they did more with the lucky block world. Right now, not that many people... Okay, a lot of people like it, but not too many people think it's that fun, because the game only has 60k players, which is really, really, really bad for the weekend. Even though it's pretty much the evening, it's not night yet, but usually on update days, the game had a lot more players. I mean, it's understandable, because the lucky block world is fun at first. After you get some pets and no huges, it kind of just takes like hours and hours of running around just to get like a couple upgrades. I grinded for maybe two hours yesterday and only got like one point something billion, so I'd probably have to grind for maybe three or four hours just to get the last upgrade for huge hatching luck alone, which is kind of a lot of time just for one upgrade. But knowing Pet Simulator X's community, everyone likes free huges. You can hatch free huges in the Lucky Block world, so I'd say at least 80% of people probably voted the thumbs up, so it is like a really, really low chance for them to not make the Lucky Block world permanent. Since everyone's voting yes to it, then they're probably gonna keep it permanent. Like, no matter what they do, if they make a board that you ask people to vote on something that has free huges, everyone's probably gonna vote that it's good, and if everyone votes it's bad, it's probably because you couldn't get them for free, so. But just look at how long this is gonna take. So 2.25 billion, and then the more lucky coins was 1 billion, but then they changed it to 750 million, so they could nerf some other things later, but right now there just isn't really too much to do. And lucky blocks don't give anything except for coins. I mean, they give one boost sometimes, which isn't really too helpful, because you can literally get thousands of boosts from the daycare. So legit, the only purpose of a lucky block is for coins, and every now and then, eight times super lucky eggs, which makes it really boring to grind, because if I wanted 2.25 billion, for maybe the next three hours, I'd have to run around just clicking lucky blocks and doing absolutely nothing else. Let me know in the comments what you thought about this update. I think that it's a good idea. I really like how this world looks. I just think there wasn't enough, which I mean, they're doing bi-weekly updates now, so an update every other week. So they're gonna have more time to add more content in future updates, and it's probably gonna be a bit more fun because they can think it out more, test it more, balance more things out, and probably do some more fixing glitches, which this update kind of needed because <laughs> people opened literally thousands of lucky eggs really, really easily. Yay, I'm on the blue lucky block. It does look really cool though. This looks like it would be a clickbait thumbnail, but like if a clickbait thumbnail was an area in Pet Simulator X, because there's just like one huge lucky block that's broken open and it has more lucky blocks in it. So far, I haven't hatched any of the huges, but I've opened so many super lucky eggs. I've grinded for at least like, I mean, I grinded for three hours on stream and maybe another two hours off stream. So five hours of just clicking lucky blocks as fast as I can and no huge. It is pretty easy to get the huge though. Already 7,500 exists. So if they make it permanent and don't nerf it, that huge is gonna be like, been about one and a half days since the update came out and 7,500 exists. So if we multiply that to be a whole month, that means every month what, around 150,000 more will exist. And then for the one that's kind of rare, the mimic, around 30,000 more per month. So after a few months, this is basically gonna be as common as the huge rock. Unless they make it rarer, which some people said they should if it does become permanent, which, I mean, that, that's not bad, but it's also good for grinding if you just AFK in a public server, which, I mean, people in public servers probably aren't going to be grinding too hard, but if you just AFK hatch the egg while AFK in a public server, glitches usually don't happen too much in Pet Sim X. They're pretty good at testing everything, and I just realized you can stand on the huge lucky block. Can I, can I escape from here? Nope, I can't. But I think lucky block updates are pretty fun. It would definitely be cool if, in addition to how everything currently is, if there's a percent for you to just hatch one super lucky egg and maybe the pink blocks made it 100% chance to get one super lucky egg from them. The blue ones have like a 20% chance and the yellow ones have like a 5% chance while you're opening them. I don't know. If they add chances to get other things that are at least somewhat useful while you're opening them, then it'd be a lot more fun to grind the lucky blocks. But right now you get very little coins and you have to open so many to get to 10,000. You can only really do it if you have a huge team of people and usually people get tired after clicking the same thing for like an hour or so. It's hard to grind for a long time, even if you have a team that is active in the beginning. But that is pretty much everything I wanted to mention in this video. So thank you all for watching. Like I mentioned earlier in the video about Fresh Cut, I'm starting to do some shorts on it. It's kind of like TikTok, but you can also do, well, you can't do text posts, I think. Literally just by making an account and using my referral code, you can get 25 diamonds. But yeah, make sure to follow me there. Make sure to subscribe to me on YouTube, like the video, Join my Discord server linked in the description. Do everything 
I'll see you in the description. But thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.